What is up everyone? Welcome to today's reaction video and today's reaction is the very special monthly request of my incredible Patreon follower Karen. Karen, thank you so so much for this request. Thank you for your continued support and thank you for the incredible information that you've sent me about this video because this one's going to be so cool. Not only is it a chance for me to get more Hound and Fox in front of me because I always love some Riley and Mackenzie in my day, but on top of that, it's a duet with Tim Faust and his wife, Jenica. Can't wait for that. Tim is incredible. And from what I heard of Jenica when they performed with Peter Hollins and his wife, mind blowing voice. So I can't wait for that. But on top of that, the lyric video for this song, the video clip for it, it's not just your basic lyric video that you would expect. Uh, from what uh, Karen has sent through to me, the basic, my basic understanding of this is that this is drawn in a comic book style and the artist that actually drew this was originally a home free fan art artist. Uh, they, they posted fan art in the home free server. Riley and Mackenzie then saw that, reached out to them and asked them to help with this video. Uh, their name is, and I'm going to try my best not to mispronounce this. I know that the first name is RG because Home Free basically dubbed them that from my understanding. And the last name I have confirmed with them is pronounced Cheese. So RG Cheese uh, is the artist that drew this whole film clip. Huge shout out to them. They also drew uh, Adam Rupp's new merch line. So check out Adam Rupp's merch to see more of their incredible art. And we're going to see some of it right now. I can't wait to check this out. This is The Good Stuff by The Hound and the Fox featuring Tim Faust and Jenica with art by RG Cheese. Let's go. Tell me how was your day gone? Was it as bad as your last one? Let me tell you about mine, cause it might make you feel better. Tell me what you need more. I could use a little restart. I need to... Okay, I need a minute here because first of all, I was going to say how nice it was with just the banjo and just the vocals. Mackenzie sounds amazing. I didn't get a chance to mention this earlier. This was written by Mackenzie. So uh, original song written by Mackenzie and she sounds fantastic even when it's just the plucking of the banjo. But then I was not ready for the hey and the, the beat to come in. That was, that was awesome. Also, art so far, beautiful and so adorable. It might make you feel better. Tell me what you need more I could use a little restart So come on baby, let's recharge Let me make you feel better I need a little bit more love I need more of the good stuff I need a little bit more light More things right between us I love that. Karen did mention to me that everything in the film clip as well is, uh, it, it's, it's all taken from their real life. So like that is the, 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 the drawing we got here. It's not just, you know, them with, I, I knew they had a child, but it's not just them child and random pets to fill in space. They actually have two cats and a puppy dog, which is so cute. Uh, absolutely loving this so far. Also the lyrics to this are just beyond adorable. I absolutely love a song that's just, I need, I, I need you to re help me recharge. I need you, uh, like I, I need, I need the light that you bring into my life. I love that. Need a little bit more light, more things right between us. I need a little bit less of this mess and to clean up. So come on, give me some more love and more. Tell me. Oh, wait. Okay. So first of all, putting it out there, um, I, I was not ready to transition into Tim's voice and I wasn't, <laughs> I wasn't ready. I was like, Oh, okay. We're going into Tim now because his voice comes in and it's just so more. And I was like, Oh, okay. That was unexpected. That completely shut down my brain. Then I've almost completely forgotten what I was going to say, but 
uh, this little, I, I, I want to know, I, cause if I, I'm not sure if when they say that, you know, this is all taken from real life, how, uh, oh, sorry, didn't mean to pause there. Uh, how in depth we are with that because this, this little, stuff. Come on, give me this part, this little scene here of them kind of on a picnic with the banjo, that's adorable. And I want to know, was that drawn for this film clip or for this song because she got to hear the song and knew there was banjo in it? Or if it was just like, is, is this, is this a date they went on? Is this from another film clip? I'm so curious as to some of these stories. Cause it's so cute seeing the just at home stuff, but then it's like, I, I want to know so much more. Me that good stuff. Tell me where is this world gone? I can't even turn the news on, on. So tell me, honey, where should we run? That could make us feel better. Tell me what you need more of. Could it be that we have enough? So come on, baby, don't give up. I want to make you feel better. I need a little bit more love. I need more of the good stuff. I love these lyrics so much. Like I obvious, I'm not commenting enough on the fact that the vocals are gorgeous as well. Both, both, you know, Riley and Mackenzie and Tim and Jenica, they've all sounded amazing. They have all sounded incredible, but I am just so lost in number one, how cute this comic book is. Like I want a printed off version of this comic that I can just have as like, you know, I'll put it right next to my heart stopper comic. Cause it's just as cute and adorable. But taking that aside, uh, the, the lyrics to this song are just so beautiful and they're so needed. I don't know when this was written uh, compared to where we are now in the world, but I'm, I'm willing to roll the dice here and say things haven't really gotten better. <laughs> um, so yeah, I, 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 I feel like this is as needed, if not more needed now than it was back then, because sometimes this is just how you feel. Sometimes it is just that kind of, you look around at the way the world is and it is absolutely a dumpster fire. And you look at the news and just how negative everything seems. But you need that one person that's just the light in your life and brings that smile to your face. And even if it's just for five minutes in the day, can make all of that fade away completely and just recharge you and let you take on the rest of the world. And this song is so bloody beautiful for that. It is so perfect and on the nose and the art could not be better for it either because it is just the absolute cutest. Less of this mess and the clean up. So come and give me some more love and more of the good stuff. Tim. Come on, give me that Tim's puppy. I love that Tim's puppy's in there. Responsibilities are giving me anxiety. Won't you please make it go away? The world is shaking me, but I got all I need. When you know the right things to say. That image, I need to scroll back there. Well, first of all, recipe, chocolate, aquarium visit, ice cream cuddle, Harry Potter movie marathon. Give me a night with Tim Faust doing just the things on that list any day of the freaking week. Seriously, like, oh my gosh. Uh, but this, this right here, that is everything. That artwork I love. The, the world on fire around them, but nothing else matters. Nick can't touch them because they're there with each other. Just the freaking cutest. Oh, wait, I didn't even miss the fact that there was another to-do list back here. Oh, sorry, I didn't even see the fact I should say. We need to go back to that. Sorry, guys, here we go. Uh, to-do list, be a mum, post for home free, clean the house, make the world a better place. Yo, honestly, honestly, it's your job to just, you know, make the entire world a better place. You know, like, on, like the, the responsibilities we put on ourselves 
is too much and we could never achieve it. And I love the fact that there's that to-do list and then we jump forward and the updated to-do list that he's fixed up is all you need is some time for yourself. Like, I love that. I love that so much. Things to say. Give me the recipe. I'll be your therapy. I can make you feel better. Oh, honey, can't you see? The answer's you and me. you Riley I am not ready for you doing these kind of I, I don't know okay someone let me know what you do that what, what that's called when they do that because y'all I grew up we in the 90s with the boy bands I grew up with the Backstreet Boys and this moment of there's the main melody going on then there's the one person coming through with like this lead vocal I love it I adore it and I want to know what it's properly called when one singer does that out of group because I was not prepared for that at all and it hit so right. Can't you see the answer's you and me? First of all, I've got to put it out there. I love, I love these speech bubbles, just the smallest little thing. Since I made this bloody channel, um, I've used the colors purple and green the whole time and all the speech bubbles are purple and green. And I just, it's, it's just so happy in my brain, but I am not okay with how each and every one of them, when they did those little call out notes, like I said about when I first mentioned Riley doing it, every one of them sounded like they were, like it was perfect absolutely perfect. I love that they didn't just do it with just Riley or, you know, just Mackenzie coming through with it. Cause normally when you have that group, uh, it's always one person. And like, as an example here, just, uh, just solely an example, usually like with, uh, Backstreet Boys or that it's the person most of the time that they consider the lead singer. Like I believe originally it used to be Brian that would do a lot of those kind of moments. And like, if you look at as an example, uh, and this isn't not me not saying the, the lead singer thing here, but just at, with Home Free, for example, a lot of the time, not always, but a lot of the time, if they have a big wailing note like that, while the rest of the song's going on, it's going to be Austin that does it. And to have a song like this, where they have the multiples of it, but each person has a turn doing it, just worked so well. And I loved it. So good. Good stuff. Oh my God, everything about that was fantastic. Yo. Do not lie for a second here. If you were in a relationship right now, you would kill to have the incredibly talented RG do a comic book of your relationship. That would be everything. And if you're single, you probably just want them to do a comic book of your life because it. this was the cutest thing ever. Um, I, I adore that so, so much, but the song itself taking like as hard as it is taking the little film clip they made aside, the song itself is just a gorgeous song. I am sending this to Peter. The second I am done here, I'm sending it to him and be like you, like this is you. Uh, but yes, it, it is just, I, I adore this. I adore it so, so much. And the fact that it is a perfect song mixed with perfect vocals, mixed with a perfect video clip is just amazing. 10 out of 10 for this one. Let's see if there's anything else to the clip here.
I also love the way they did the instrumentation of this as well, by the way, because it like, like I said, that start off with the banjo and then the shift with the hay felt so good. And the whole song was like that. It was built beautifully. Uh, absolutely incredible. As always, guys, please check out the original video linked in the description below. Give it a like, give it a comment and subscribe to The Hound and The Fox if you haven't already. Also check out Tim Faust's solo channel where he does a lot of songs with a lot of people and a lot of songs by himself. He has in some incredible doo-wop stuff. So check all of that out. I will, uh, also, yes, that's, no, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Please leave a like and a comment on this video and subscribe if you haven't already. We're less than 100 people now to 15,000. Let's go. Uh, also check me out over on Patreon where I run weekly polls for the reactions that I do. I also do two weekly TV show reactions, a monthly movie reaction, a monthly live stream, which is coming up in like a day or so. I think about two days now. So uh, check that out. And at the highest tier, you can get a guaranteed reaction right here on the channel. So check all that out over on my Patreon. I will see you all in the next reaction video. Have a great day, night, morning, evening, afternoon, whatever time zone you're in. And I'll see you next time. Bye.